My name is Vincent Mehele, Secretary of the African Development Bank. I want to welcome you to the 55th Annual Meetings of the African Development Bank and the 46th Annual Meetings of the African Development Fund. The annual meetings this year are being conducted virtually. Virtually for obvious reasons because of the COVID-19 pandemic, which has made it impossible for our governors to gather together in person in Abidjan, the host city of this year's annual meetings. At these annual meetings, of course, the world is reeling from the pandemic where millions of people have been infected and hundreds of thousands of people have died all over the world. And that is not lost on us at the African Development Bank Group. So as a result, we're taking all precautions to safeguard the health and the safety of our members, of our governors, of our executive directors, of staff members, of our alternate governors, as they participate in these annual meetings. We are grateful to all our boards of governors that approved that these annual meetings this year be conducted virtually. Of course, the election being a major agenda item would ordinarily be held in a physical meeting, but all over the world, Things have changed. We are now in the so-called new normal, whereby things have to be done virtually. And also because of the COVID-19 pandemic, the annual meetings have been so streamlined such that there are only statutory items that are being attended to. As I mentioned earlier, the election is a major agenda item. Of course, we have our governor's dialogue where our governors will dialogue on how the bank has progressed in meeting the commitments made for the seventh general capital increase and the ADF 15 replenishment. We will not have the usual knowledge events that we have where we have thousands of people participating because this meeting this year, as I said, have been strictly streamlined. So it's indeed an opportunity for us to test out once again this new normal in our virtual annual meetings where we intend to conduct the business of the bank. 